Hello everyone, today we're here in Los Angeles and we're gonna be doing a little real estate tour. We're going to luxury apartments and we had New York condo tours on my channel. So I was like, you know what, we're here. So why not make a vlog or make a video on LA luxury tours. We have here Addison Chen and we have Michelle Lam, our LA resident, technically yes. a New York resident. And I'm the New Yorker that's driving. <laughs> So we're supposed to be looking oh, for a place. Oh, I see it. It's right here. That's it over there. Your destination is on the left. We're going to be primarily looking at two apartments in North Hollywood. So it's not necessarily indicative of how it's like in all of Los Angeles, but this at least we'll see how it's like. What you would get in so LA. do you know how much is this particular place's rent? Very expensive. This is why this one was for fun. <laughs> I'm going to put the number on the screen. Oh, open house. So it looks like they might have like some retail or restaurant under here.
Michelle? Sally, if you don't rent out this place, I'll be so disappointed. <laughs> Tommy has to split. Mm, Tommy, I know you make that bank, so yeah, no Tommy, excuses. Tommy, you make that six figure salary. I need, I need Plus my salary, back. it's like double six. Right now, we put this This is the live garden, so all the live plants. So, so Sally, what are your thoughts? I came into this thinking I'm not going. It was, it this unit was like supposed to be like for giggles, as in like, oh yeah, you know, we're just gonna go in. It's bougie. I thought it was gonna be more over the top from like the building, but the layouts are actually pretty nice. The more simpler ones too I think like layout wise I, I feel like there are other apartments I've been looking at in LA and their layouts are kind of questionable with like doors going into the bathroom and like or the door basically connecting the master and the living room and whatnot or sometimes you have to go through the master to go to the bathroom I'm like that's not bueno for me I don't like how, that kind of layout but I like the layout of this I mean, I actually probably would consider a studio, but yeah, you know, you never know. Yeah, never there was know. a lot of natural sunlight too. Yeah. yeah, and the neighborhood, I feel like this is my kind of neighborhood. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so the next place we're going to is called LNO Apartments. Yeah.
Why hello there. We have just finished viewing LNO. So Sally, what did you think of LNO? I really liked it. I see myself living there. It's a very great community. I highly recommend Denny to be your tour guide. He treated us well. And he Lots even gave us some dry stuff. <laughs> so he truly knows us. Um, if Tommy was there, my boyfriend, and he just bribed us with this, Tommy would have slammed the agreement down already. But unfortunately, he didn't come here. But there's always next time. Um, so what did you think compared to Magnolia? Magnolia is a, where I want to be in life as a condo. Um, LNO is like where I am in life and mm -hmm. realistic. Yeah, uh -huh. as you guys can see from the footage, it seemed a lot more, I think, homier, more yeah. creative as well. Like there's like an actual... They had stuff. They had courtyard. They had amenities. The other place was very private. That's what that was. And it was more suburban. This one was more popping in the arts district. Yeah. Plus Magnolia, it just feels like you would live there like five years or something as an actual house with mm -hmm. all that, with the ones with the space. But I mean, I don't plan to live in apartments for mm -hmm. like maybe, I plan to live there for like two years. Yeah. And then put. Per, per, potentially purchase a home yeah so this would actually <laughs> kick me out at one point unfortunately but yeah i like this yeah. hi tommy um <laughs> i have the floor pan you know there's the pricing um just letting you know <laughs> one thing that we didn't really like was that as you can see from the tour sometimes the doors of the bathroom hit the doors of the washing machine and also like the doors of the bedroom that the bathroom door to the bathroom to the kitchen slash living room area they would clash if they were open at the same yeah. time honestly actually um online i actually chose this apartment because it's one unit didn't have that but i guess that unit wasn't available mm. for obvious reasons maybe because people <laughs> it was just too it. good yeah but i mean i don't think in the long run it bothers me it'll just be like for the other door just yeah. be like for guests or something but in the long run it doesn't yeah. matter I mean if a door is gonna be the most of your problems about yeah. an apartment I think that says a lot I'm just excited to come over and go into your pool yeah I buy a house in LA but I go to everyone else's apartment <laughs> <laughs> yeah I actually even asked like hey can you sublet or can it be Airbnb no because otherwise it w I was like mm, you know it could have been a little passive income there maybe yeah, that was, she didn't ask that for Magnolia, but she asked that for LOL, so she was really impressed yeah, too, especially I just like, I just like to kind of have a place where I can come here and say like, hey, I'm just going to hang out, and then if I'm not here, I'll make income, mm -hmm. or will make income, right? Yeah. What did you like about it? Because I saw you were like, I'm sold in certain parts. The gym, the uh, thinking space, the courtyard area, barbecue stuff, and the pool. I also just kind of like how the inside of the apartment has some fucking color in it. Like, I mm -hmm. like cleanliness. I do like that sleek, funky curve of Magnolia. It's very sterile. But yeah, it feels a little too sterile, and I appreciate like some contrast, <laughs> you know? Oh, also a plus is that if I want an accent wall, they will paint it for yeah, me, and I don't really have to nice. paint it back. Yeah. Unless I paint it myself. Which, why the fuck would I do that? Was that a myself? promotional thing, or did they say, like, they no, would do that? No, they will do it. Like, before move-in, mm -hmm. they will have somebody paint it for, like, $100, which is honestly mm -hmm. not bad, because that takes away the time. Um, I don't have to personally do it and make sure everything's great, and I don't have to paint it back um, after I move out. Mm -hmm. So... Plus, if you did it yourself, in which you can see in my little apartment vlog, you have to come in two times. It's a the pain in the ass. Yes. And yeah. you may not. You, you'll just still have a lot of shit that you'll just throw out. Yeah, maybe it was a sign. I had, I asked for other apartment viewings. They never got back to me, even though I texted them and emailed them and called them. Maybe it was just a sign. You know, Magnolia <laughs> was just like, hey guys. This is just a gallery viewing, but it was a fun gallery viewing. I don't know. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Some snacks. Um, pretty handsome. I'm also sexy and body like a god, so perfect for me. That's all I have to say about that. Thanks, Tommy. <laughs>